What's up guys, how you doing? Today, we're gonna be putting this grill in, taking this old one out. I'm gonna show you how to do it, how simple it hopefully should be, and we're gonna go from there. Now, with this, there are, I think, only two fasteners, one up here. Um, I'll show you a clip of that. And there's one on the exact opposite side. Now this one has a front license plate bracket as well. And I think that might be fastened to something in here. There are two screws, there's one in here, one in here, and don't mind it saying Z28. I don't know why. The, the previous owner had put a Z28 hood on here and maybe a front grill, I'm not sure. Um, but this says Z28 on it, but it's not, it's an RS. I got my little wear a tool kits. Let's see if we can get it off with these. So I'm gonna take my T30 bit, snap it in there, let's go to town. And this should maybe just come off now, maybe. Is there another bolt? Oh, there's a third bolt down here. Also, if anybody wants this piece, comment down below. Maybe I'll give it to you. Uh, I'll just give it away to somebody. I don't know who, I'll just pick somebody randomly in the comments. If this is a, maybe a piece you need, hit me up, you can have it. Okay, now that I have that license bracket off, I can see there is one and, where is it at? Two other little bolts that are fastening that part in. So I'm gonna take those out. <clears throat> All right, accidentally forgot to hit the record button, but these are those screws that were in there. And now the bottom seems like it's loose. So we just have to get this one out and that one out up there and we should be good. Okay, so this thing's pretty much already coming apart. So I'm just gonna probably, instead of trying to dig in there with a right angle driver or whatever, I'm just gonna maybe cut pieces out of here so I can get up into this little slot here to get those out. Okay, it's just like, it's just like shattering. So, there we go. Let's get the other side. Oh yeah, that's so brittle. All right, and then we're gonna grab our right angle driver from Wera. Guys, this isn't sponsored by Wera. I just, maybe I'm just so proud of my new tools. I love them. I'll link this kit down below. You probably saw me do a review on this on the channel, but I love this kit. All right, T15. Break off some more of this. And get a better, better reach on it. And it is actually, here let me show you, clip some of this stuff off. It's actually held in by one more screw down here. So I have to get that out somehow. Oh, I can just go underneath here. All right, got all those screws out. Let's do some cleaning here. Look at all that gunk on there, dang. That's gross. That's real grody. And then this will just pop in there like that. Look at that. Okay, now this grill here at the top, as you can see here at the top, it has the hole right here for the screws that go on the top, but it does not have holes in the bottom for the screws that go in the bottom. But there are a couple holes here and right there on both sides here that you could drill into this right here. So for now, I'm only gonna secure the top two screws and we'll see how that works. If I hear any shaking or vibrating from the front, then I'll know that I need to secure some more with these side pieces. So I'm gonna pop this in, get some shots, and here's gonna be some before and after shots. Uh, before it just looked, I don't know, just kinda old and outdated for sure. I mean, the whole car is definitely old and outdated, but um, this new grill definitely gives it a new, cooler look. Uh, I love it a lot. It looks so cool. And remember guys, if you want this little license plate bracket, comment down below and I'll pick one of you guys and I'll send it out to you. you gotta live in America. I'll ship it out to you for free. All right guys, that's the end of the video. I'll link this uh, wear a toolkit down below. I'll link the grill down below. Um, I'll link my uh, OnlyFans down below. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't have one of those. Uh, but yeah, that's the end of the video guys. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.